I'm Elida Greendike, and I've been a proud breeder of Leonbergers for the past more than 25 years. Uh, the Leonberger was originally from Leonberg, Germany, hence the name Leonberger. They're a working dog because they were bred from three other similar working breeds. The official history says um, Newfoundland, St. Bernard, and Great Pyrenees. The, the person who created the breed was trying to create a large, impressive dog because they were very popular with royalty at that time. Uh, so they were, Leonbergers were in, in many royal uh, palaces and, and homes um, in the 1800s. I've always been a dog lover since the time I was a small child and I always loved big dogs and uh, I happened to see one in 1989. I'll never forget it because it was changed my life. Uh, I saw this large dog, I didn't know what it was and I asked the owner and it turned out it was a very rare Leonberger at the time. Um, at the time, there were only two known Leonbergers in the state of New Jersey, and I happened to be lucky enough to see one. And I got my first Leonberger in 1990, and I have not looked back. I've had them ever since. I've attended every national specialty since 1990. Uh, I was just so intrigued and interested in the breed that I wanted to be part of preserving and protecting the breed, and one of the main um, ways in which to do that is to breed and to breed quality Leonbergers. So um, that's got me involved in breeding. I had my first litter in 1995 and I've had many, many litters since. So I do get up early and I spend probably about an hour and a half just making sure everyone's fed and has fresh water. And if I have a litter, then I have to spend even more time. Just I spend some time with them in the morning. Uh, I have two adult daughters help during the day. And then when I come home, then the work just starts all over again. Just um, a lot of time and, and attention for a litter of puppies. Uh, Dario is my male and last year he was best of breed at Westminster. I had a handler showing him that year and he was, for a Leonberger, still a very young dog. He was two and a half and uh, he, he had his moment of fame. Um, he goofed, he was just completely goofy in Madison Square Garden in the breed, the group judging and became an instant overnight sensation. And uh, at, when it actually happened, I was in the stands at the garden and I was mortified that that was my dog acting that way. But the crowd went wild and loved him and he became an internet sensation. And so that was, that is probably, when I mention Dario to people, they say, oh, was is it that Dario, the one who was in Westminster? And so, yeah, and then we, uh, we ended up with an appearance on uh, Good Morning America, uh, the famous Dario. So that, that was certainly stands out as my most memorable moment.